seeing some uh, lower temps. <laughs> Yeah. Quite a change. Yeah, quite a change is right. Yeah, we absolutely have much cooler air in place right now. It's anywhere from about 10 to 20 degrees cooler than yesterday morning. Asheville, not quite such a difference. 12 degrees down there, but still impressive. 20 degrees cooler in Greenwood and Clemson. 22 degrees cooler out in Rutherfordton. So the chill is upon us. It's going to stick around all throughout the day today. The morning, though, is actually even cooler than what we're used to for this time of year. Our averages for morning lows this time of, the, of uh, September sit in the low to mid 50s. Today, 40s and lower 50s, so about five, even six degrees cooler than what's typical for this time of the year. It all comes in the wake of yesterday's cold front. That system is now pushing all the clouds and the rain offshore, leaving us with a clearing sky and sunshine on the way. We will eventually see that sun come through uh, these early morning dark moments, but 723 is when that sun comes up. So dark until then, but then gorgeous. Temperatures are cooling still. It's in the upper to lower 40s in the mountains. We've got low 50s in most of the upstate, but places like Greenwood have now dropped down to about 49 degrees. So just be prepared for that chill in the air. Highs today will get comfortable. It'll be sunny and nice after a cool morning, reaching 72 degrees in the upstate. Western North Carolina getting to 67 degrees after a cool start. So we do have this kind of perfect fall weather all throughout the day today, which means on the sky meter, I get to put it up to a perfect 10 for you today. And I do anticipate a couple perfect 10s in a row for the remainder of this week. Tomorrow's a gorgeous day. It'll start chilly again, but the temperatures become more mild in the afternoon. You'll have plenty of sunshine. Temperatures could get into the mid and even upper 70s for Thursday afternoon, but that won't last long. We've got another cold front coming in for the end of the week. Friday morning, cool and clear Friday afternoon. That chilly air starts to settle back in and by the weekend, I'm talking a full fall crisp. It's going to be much cooler than what we have been seeing. We've got to talk about the tropics briefly. There are no named storms right now in the Atlantic Basin is fairly quiet, but there's about a 50% chance for development in the Southern Caribbean Sea right now. We'll be watching that closely and it looks like it would impact areas of Mexico's Yucatan Peninsula by the time we get to late in the weekend, possibly early next week. So a couple days away from even developing still, but we'll watch that closely, though it does not look to have an impact on our area or really most of the East Coast. Temperatures today 72 with sun tomorrow, 78 with sunshine, a bit of a warm up for the 1st of October. Then Friday onward, it cools back down 60s during the day, 40s at night, and I expect this weekend some of the higher elevations to get into the 30s. So be prepared for that kind of chill. Sunday, you'll see a few passing clouds and really beautiful weather overall. And then next week, a slight warm up begins.